and you put those two together. Hi, I'm David Boyle. I work for Oracle, and I'm responsible for media technology solutions within our marketing department. And when we talk about the word conversion in the context of online video, sometimes the traditional marketing usage of the word conversion can apply. In other words, I want to convert this viewer of the video into a sales lead. Um, but we can look at conversion as something that extends to potentially converting someone into an event attendee, either an online event or a physical event. Um, converting someone into a sales lead, but collecting their uh, name, address, email, department, role, and then potentially including them in our content marketing strategy uh, to push them relevant content based on the information they provide to us. So the opportunity to use video within your marketing mix uh, can enable other forms of conversion besides the uh, traditional sales lead conversion. A great way for brand marketers to move someone toward a conversion using video is to understand who you're trying to convert. What are their interests? What are their business problems? What world do they operate in? What kind of content or approach would be compelling to them or that they would find authentic? One of the most important things to think about when you're coming up with a marketing strategy aside from your objective, although that's important, is who you're talking to. And once you understand who you're talking to and what their needs are, you will be more effective and you'll get traction and engagement from that content. A great way to think about conversion is, what action do I want my viewer of the video to take? Do I want them to go to a web page and get more information? Do I want them to fill out an online form or attend an event? How do you do that? Well, for us, one of the ways we do that is when we post a video on YouTube, and typically those videos are teaser videos, videos that are a sneak preview of content you can get elsewhere, or the value of attending a certain event or in buying a product, for example. When you provide a clear call to action within the frame of the video to tell the user what they should do to follow up, to get more information, and then augment that, supplement it, by including a URL in the video's description, in the about field on YouTube, for example, that the user can click and go where you want them to go. That's a really easy, quick way to convert. Social media. Ed Nick is now he's on his own. He does some work.